Hey guys, I'm back and I know I might look a little different. Um, I did a couple things to my hair. I straightened it, I cut my bangs, I... <laughs> just two things. Um, but I did cut my own bangs myself and I did straighten my hair myself. But um, that's not the point of the video. The point of the video is my elf haul and... Da -da 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 -da. I got some elf from the mail. I ordered probably a while ago and I've had this stuff for a while so I've been using it but don't be afraid because I haven't used it all but I can do a little mini reviews on some of them because I have tried a, some of them so let's get started with the first couple things which are just a couple backups which aren't too special but um, I still did buy them um, I got an extra complexion perfection because I was running out and I did need another one so here's it's still in the box because I don't like taking them out of the box well, I don't like taking them all out of the box. Um, I got a backup of my Gotta Go blush, which is like this white with a gold reflex in it. So if I like, you can probably see it shimmer in the light with the gold reflex. It's right here. Maybe. I don't know. It's really pretty though. I wear it every single day on my cheekbones and on my nose. If you watch my highlighting video, which should be up soon, um, you'll know what I'm talking about. Um, another backup that I got is my review, or <laughs> my e.l.f. eyebrow kit in medium, because I did make a dent in my wax already. This is the only eyebrow stuff I will use besides NYX cake powder, which is the stuff that I use over my wax. I don't use this side at all, but I do use this side a lot. So this is a major, major must-have. You know, I think I might do a must-have video for me, like, um, some drugstore must-haves. I don't know. That's just a maybe. Okay, so now the rest of the stuff I have never tried before and, or at least that color I have never tried before and I'm very excited to show you. So the first thing which I have used is my cream liner in the color Plum Purple. And this one actually disappointed me in a way. Not the color, the color is amazing. There it is right there. I'll do a little swatch of it even though it's going to come out looking like black, but it is purple. It's purple. Um, the only thing that disappointed me about this was the creaminess. It's way, 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 way too creamy to be a cream liner. I know cream liners are supposed to be creamy, but this is like liquid once you put it on your brush. It's really, really creamy. Um, my black one that I have is kind of stiff, and I don't know if it's because I've had it for so long um, and the texture just became like that, but... Um, I really like the stiff liner. I don't like pencil though, so I don't want to use pencil. I like cream liner that's stiff. <laughs> um, but I did try using this and I, I've only used it once and I had to dig in because the creaminess just wouldn't stay on my brush. I don't know. But it is a pretty color. Okay, the next thing that I've been loving from my e.l.f. haul is this e.l.f. blush in Peachy Keen. I've never tried this blush before, so I thought I'd pick it up. And it's a very, very nice... I think you could use this as a highlight, too. I'm actually wearing it. No, I'm not. Um, you could use this as a highlight because it is sheer enough. But I do like using it as a blush. You probably can't even see it on my finger. It's on my middle one. But it is a very gorgeous um, color. No, you can't see it. Um, it's just a peachy color. Uh, I think I might use this as a highlight during the summertime when my skin's a little darker um, because this would go perfect as a highlight just because it has that gold kind of sheen like the Gotta Glow blush does. But it's really gorgeous as a blush too. This next one's going to shock you a little bit, okay? I got this blush and I knew it was going to be super, super bright pink. But the pigmentation is super bright pink too. So this is called Pink Passion. Ah! It's super bright. Super, super bright. Um... It's like neon. I don't know. It's like crazy. But there's a pigmentation. It is still really, really bright. But once you put it on your skin, it's kind of like Barbie doll pink. I don't know. I really like it, and I have used this one already. Um, the only problem I have with it is I can't put too much on or else I look clownish. So if I do wear this color, I wear it with a very, very, very neutral eye. Like I could have pulled, pulled it off today because I'm not, not wearing anything on my eyes. Could have pulled it off today, but I'm wearing something else on my cheeks, which I'll link down below what it is. I know you guys are going to be curious about it. So, yeah, this is P uh, Pink Passion. Um, I got two more things. Um, I did get a, an angled foundation brush from the studio line, but I did give it to my sister just because I didn't like it. I didn't like it at all. I was going to use it 
for like contouring but it's way too thin for contouring okay so the next thing that I've definitely I'm definitely gonna be buying more of is this pressed powder from elf in the color buff it's the perfect shade for me right now I know it looks a little light but it's the perfect shade I'm actually wearing it right now and this thing keeps popping out because there used to be a brush underneath there and I freaking hated it so I took it out but this if I can show you this is what it looks like okay and the color is perfect to my skin tone once I blend it out and everything it's perfect I uh, can't even see it because I blended it out but it was useless but it is really nice it it does stay on all day and I didn't even use a primer today and I put my makeup on probably um, 6.30 this morning I don't see any wear or tear and it is currently almost 10 to 1 I mean, you probably can't read my clock but it's 10 to 1 um, yeah this is really nice I really like it and I will definitely be ordering more and the last thing that I got besides that angled foundation brush is this really awesome blush brush it's from the studio line and it's just called a blush brush and it looks like this super fluffy it's really 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 fluffy um, it's kind of like a tapered blush brush because it like kind of goes to a point um, <clears throat> I really 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 like it this is I apply it just like I'll put the let's try some of this peachy king I'll put some of my blush on there to get it on here and then I'll go smile and I'll just pat it on like this and then of course blend it out and stuff I don't know it's really really nice it gets right where you need it to go and uh, yeah I like it so eh, super pretty okay so that was my elf haul and you know lately I just haven't been ordering from elf and I don't know why I really really need to start doing that again but I really don't need any more makeup that's the hard part about it um I've just been buying clothes lately because that's what I need for the summertime but I hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching